After doing a quick search for pink and orange in Google, I came across the image for the inspiration behind this design on LayoutSparks.com. You'll need a thin art brush, makeup wedge, and the polishes for this design. Using a damp makeup sponge, you're going to start by creating your gradient background. And though I didn't film it here, I do have lots of other tutorials with a gradient background, and I'll include a link below in the description for you. For this design, I've put a little bit of white polish on a piece of tin foil, and I'm just using my thin art brush to create this design. This flower is basically made with four hearts. It kind of looks like a clover, except for the four hearts don't touch where a clover you would have those connected. And in between one of the sets of hearts, you're gonna create kind of a curved line, a little bit thicker in the center and thinned out as it gets to the tip. And then you're gonna place some dots on either side of that. The heart shapes don't have to be perfect. It's nice if you can get them similar in size, but each of the flowers can be different sizes. And I'd like to add just a small dot also in the center of each of those flowers. So continue building those flower shapes on your nails until your nails are full. You can have some of the flower shapes peeking off the side of your nail, similar to what I did with that first flower that I placed on this middle finger. Once you're happy with the number of flowers you've added to your nail, allow that to dry and apply your top coat. And that's pretty much it for this design. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you liked the video. Please tune in next time.